Right, okay, so um, here I'm running uh, the Extreme Tuner tool that um, Galax provide. And um, it's pretty basic. You don't get um, the sort of utilities that you get with something like MSI Afterburner. So um, recommendation is just use MSI Afterburner for doing any overclocking um, fan curves. Uh, this doesn't even support uh, fan curves. Um, but you will want to use this uh, to manage um, the RGB LEDs on the uh, fan. Now, um, you can see there at the moment, um, it's uh, going through uh, different phases. That's the rainbow effect um, here. Um, you can obviously, just like other um, cards, uh, choose your pattern, you select it, uh, click apply, um, so then that's on red, you can select different color, yellow, apply, green, apply, and then also you have breathing, your different effects, cycle breathing, so light rainbow going through, um, and my favorite, LED off, I don't tend to like um, RGB. Um, so if I apply that and that's what it looks like uh, when it's um, off and you can see here it's quite shiny because you can probably hopefully see me waving <laughs> a little bit there and you can see the camera here um, so yeah it's um, yeah it's quite reflective this plastic uh, surface on it but it's quite nice when it's off I mean so it matches the case uh, so my case is all black my uh, fan for the CPU is all black so um, it's uh, nice like that um, but that's this tool I just wanted to show you that um, uh, these options are here LED 3 2 and 1 LED 1 LED 2 uh, is not selectable um, there's nothing you can do with that so it's just LED 3 um, yeah um, and that's it uh, for the LED control. And like I say, for doing overclocking fan curves, uh, use someone like MSI Afterburner or your preferred tool.